Hey, um, hey guys, this is, um, Green6800, um, this is a new YouTube, um, account, because my old one just wasn't working out. It's, um, How to PC now. This is my gay little channel because I can't have transparent anymore. Um, but a lot of things have happened, um, because you in the Photoshop stuff, um, so I can get some more of that, those to you, but as you can see, I can, I have this Mac setup, um, but, um, the only reason why I have two is because I got, um, this thing called, um, it's called Object Doc, um, it's extremely easy to get, I'll put a link into it in the description, but I've got the, per the um, the plus version and um in fact you know what i'm just gonna show you yeah you can customize these i'm gonna show you how to do that later but um real quick i'm just gonna i'm just gonna show you where it normally is installed um it's a stardock product um which stardock see i had the free version but that wasn't working out, so I guess I can delete that now. Um, but here's the plus. Here's all the files and all that, and you can do all this stuff and add more stuff. And so yeah. But um, how do I get these custom? Um, I guess you could say icons. Well, here, let me show you. S if you right click on it and go to settings, customize this icon. Um, this is going to take you to this. I'm going to go to a file that's already installed and I'll show you how to install these. Um, I have this one called Square Glass. It's extremely useful. Um, it has, I believe, like 500. But all you do is click the whole image and it'll hit OK and it'll go. As you can see I got my Camtasia recorder as a camera and my custom Camtasia and all that stuff. Um not sure why that one popped up like that, but hold on, I'm gonna change the icon back to the one that I have right there because my Camtasia recorder needs to be boss. Okay. But so and then um another cool thing is um hold on let me go to this um is create new docket is only with the pro but I'm just going to show you so like, like all the positions like where you could put it and if you like the old uh desktop setup you can just go like this um I like it mine centered bottom edge it's, it's really customizable um size as you can see I can change my icons to really big and then I can I put this to 41 is a really good size and 60 is a good zoom size but as you can see you can put it to whatever you want um so style and color um you can change the style. Um, I have yet to figure out how this one works out, but um, I'll figure how to install more of these. But um, I'm just going to ch change it to show that you can do that, and you can make it transparent and like a boss. Um, I keep it like this. Um, another cool thing about this is um, you can add what's called a separator, and there you go say that you um say that you want all your personal stuff over here like uh cinema 4D and your notepad plus plus um that separates it so that you can easily access it um I don't put separators I just have my default programs up here and my personal programs down here um but effect zoom amount Oh uh, yeah, look at that smexy zoom. Um, I put that to I believe thirty. No, no, I think I put it to twenty then. Yeah, I put it to about twenty. 
Um, and then there's ghost mode, which is really cool because just like goes away and then you can pull it up. I don't enable it because it's kind of tricky. Um, and keep on bottom. In fact, I'm going to enable ghost mode. Um, basically, all the keep on bottom does is um, say that, say you open your thing. And um, this is a custom web page that I'm going to be doing. As you can see, this one comes up. Hold on. Dang it. This probably isn't the best example. I'll redo it. Um, quick launch docket. Um, accessibility. Um, if I put it keep on top, right? As you can see, I just put it to keep on top, and it stays on top. So if I wanted to like do something it would get in the way a lot but um so when I scroll down here it doesn't come up it comes up if I go to the exact edge but um this is just like a little tutorial I guess I could say it's more like a um I, I guess you could say it's more like a uh, shout out like a reflection oh oh one more thing um how to install picture packs um hold on, let me just do this real quick all right so say that i didn't have um dang it went to the wrong place um bundled images misc um say that i didn't have any of these say that all of these uh, these are all custom packs that I um, wanted to install um, all that I'd have to do is I'd have to open up my Internet Explorer um, you always want to go to your C drive and it's going to be under the 32-bit uh, program files um, because it's a 32 bit program, can't get it for 64. And you're gonna go to Starduck, um, Object Doc Plus. And then you're gonna go to Bundled Images, and really you can put them here, but I like to put them in mixed um, icons. And um, all you gotta do is drag, move to MISC icons, and then they will be installed. Um, but so and as you can see it's really easy to rearrange your stuff it like literally it takes about five seconds to rearrange it and um you can put it the weather on to where you are um i'm in parkville md um got calendar and you can change all these as you can see i got my custom stuff but um that's like a little shout out um hope that this will help you. I'll put the link in the description to download it. But so, anyway, um, comment, rate, and subscribe. I really need some likes and some subscribers to my new page.